It's always good to hear the side, both sides of the story. It's not good to judge by one side of the story. Now, I will say, Sergeant I will say, has come up to review what really happened, what he was going through at the time that River State Governor, since Fobara removed him as the chairman of River State Traditional Council. So I want us to take a time and watch this video that you are seeing on the screen. This is very emotional. I watched this video, I was, I don't know what to say, but then it has happened. So he shared the story, what, how he supported him Fobara during the campaign, how he, had, how he made Fobara to be his own person, but Fobara stabbed him at the back. He says Governor Fobara, Fobara actually stabbed him. So I want us to take our time and watch this video of what he told. The story was telling me some weekend when we came, visited him in his palace in Emoha, local government area of River State. Let's take our time and watch this video. When you say you saw them saying you were going to die, but remember, remember, I never went out of this thing without telling my government. I never went. Not just one, three times, all written, all acknowledged, all in writing, and all acknowledged, and I have copies. So when somebody said he didn't know where I went, I'm surprised. Only there was another chairman other than me. It's a, it's a man, like you said. It was my candidate. I took him as my own personal candidate. All the people running around him today, none of them should face. Let me also put it on record. I am the only traditional ruler, first class, that followed that campaign from local government to local government, and I'm going to every local government. And I wanted the Ross room, most of the local government area, to speak for him because I, I trusted him. I'm not a side by uh, supporter of Fumar, Governor Fumar. No, I was one of the main ones. Main, like he said, main. But today, that's why in the house of politics, you see the good, the bad, and the ugly. Anyone that fall into your hand, <laughs> that's what you, you, you believe and watch it. But I want to say, you are my friend. Nothing in this world will make me to say anything otherwise than that. I know what you did for me. I will say, yeah, I know what he, he did for me. I know what he did for me. I wrote three letters. Three letters to my governor to so please allow me to go and look after myself. And if I had remained one week later, I would have died here. I would have died here. And he said, You told me when you saw him, he said, Nothing will make you to die. Put your courage and remain, remain safe, you will not die. Continue to pray. That's what you told me. And now, those who did not know, how we, we went to to the to the farm to get the, the wood that made the fire. You are not even part of the catching of the animal and anything. Just the wood to cook. You are not here. Now we are the bad people now. I am the bad man. I am not a bad man. I was sacked from my seat the day I was a I see you. The day I said my eyes, you just took care of me. I was in coma for 10 hours. Only he knew that he said nothing to anybody. He didn't know the airport. Only him, I told. I didn't tell anybody. Because everyone rejected me. The government that was happy rejected me. And people have money to say, I will support the governor to the fullest. What do you, why would you not support him to the fullest when he didn't contribute to his being there? Didn't you have your candidate in there with run the election? Where, 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 where is it? To join your candidate. But we thank God. We give God all the glory. Your yeah. coming today is, has added another life to me. Telling you, I am learning how to stand up because I was in ICU like this six weeks.
sit like this on the bed. Six weeks with badges on no mama. I don't know what they have put on my fed from my nose. And you tell people when I was in high CU that I'm a man of, of questionable character, that I never steady, Sergeant Dawusa is not steady, about. That's one quality that I think I don't I don't deserve that one. Call me any other name, don't tell me that I'm not steady. I am a steady human being. So you don't know what you are doing for us. Not for me, for all of us here. Anybody who is with you, you will touch the person's life. Now you save the life. Why shouldn't I say so? I, I'm the right to say so. All of them jumping, gallant mountain in government. We never saw them. I suffered. I followed the 23 local government I went to. I went to 23 local government campaign. I went to 23 local government or X number of local government I went for flag off and commissioning. All I went. I was a first class traditional ruler. Nobody complained. Nobody complained. Now, I'm being subject of descriptions in different media. But I thank you very much of my life. Every other thing doesn't matter. Every other thing that I said, anybody that is with them, with uh, anybody that is not supporting me, since I say you are the only friend I have, that I say you should not come to my house. No. Yesterday, or the first day, a more of a council of chiefs, all of them came here. Two of them, or three of them, are coordinators of sin. They are coordinators of sin. Why? I'm a politician of uh, that kind of character. I'm a liberal politician. They're steady on my course when I move. You know, one major thing that we have, we have found the life in that. I know very well. I was watching television one day. And I watched when the governor said, that one, that one, that can be like this thing. And then that's my hand on that I removed. This was one of the few people who made sure on the day we are deciding who will run as government or who will run. So that was a one to one person who insisted that that ticket should be given to the government. And this is also the same government who never bothered to ask where is Chief House. Even if the call is to them, where is their father? Where is their father? But we're on television casting a picture to somebody who one of us are regarding politics. When politics was politics, I don't know where the governor was there, which I would say was running the commission. I don't know where it was, the primary school or what, the secondary school. But that's the whole part of uh, uh, life. But that maybe I tell you that the society we are in, once you have hope in God, you have no problem. Mm -hmm. If you want to have hope in God, it will be, uh, it, it, it doesn't come in that smooth way. Sometimes it's very rough that can make you to lose uh, hope. But at the end of the day, they are not in the other. So, on behalf of all of us who is a very thank God Almighty, thank you. God for your life, thank God for your wife's life and your children. I know when they were possible, particularly your son Joe, who was always coming to this day and making sure that I talk to you on phone. In fact, I think I was too much against me to you. That again was a problem, but I was trying to stay away because you did a stubborn person. The doctors would say, Don't talk. But you want somebody who will talk to you. So we try to also help you a lot, uh, you know, and force you to talk. But we thank God you are alive and you continue to operate. Thank you for watching. Please do want to drop your comments on this. What do you think concerning this? Drop your comments on what you think concerning what Sergeant Awuse said on his ordeal in the house of uh, Fubara of River State. And don't forget to give me a thumb up and subscribe to this channel. See you in my next video. Bye.